good morning everybody I have gone from the nice and hot to the freezing cold we are in Poland in Gdańsk and I'm just having a morning on the beach by my pals and it's just incredible obviously freezing as you can see I'm here with Stefania and Holly we're having a little girls holiday um, but the temperatures have dropped um, and it's freezing but I'm well wrapped up I've been here a few days and the first few days I just didn't want to vlog because we just got here and we just did so much I've had my bloods done I've had uh, my teeth cleaned which really brightened them I didn't realize how dull they were uh, my teeth are fine thankfully and what else did we do we've eaten a lot uh, this is the first walk we've come on because yesterday rained all day but yeah I'm so happy to be here as usual this is a much more chilled trip there's nothing really for me to do other than the usual oh we had a little glow up we had a facial the day we arrived it, um I had the facial was a bloomier facial first time I heard of it but it's sort of deep exfoliation and it was really lovely and it did wonders for my skin because I do suffer with um, scarring from my acne I've not had a breakout since it and I've not really worn any makeup so so far so good but yeah we're heading to Sopot now we're walking the whole thing Stefania's getting her ears cleaned later and oh also Stefania found out that she in fact has eczema on her hand um, those of you would have seen in the last video on the plane she had a little glove on to protect her hand she's got eczema and she's also got white patches on her skin on her tummy which is I can't I can't remember the word in English but it's um, a fungus that lives on our skin already but for some people it can affect them a little bit when they get too hot and sweaty um, so it's quite controllable in fact hers is basically gone she's got the knowledge on herself which is which is what you want uh, our blood tests come in today so I'll update you on those but yeah that's a little update for you we're gonna head to Sopot Holly this is the first time she's come to Poland Holly for those of you that don't know is a girl that I've known from before school like we lived on the same street we met at school but very young like primary school so it's her first time here and yeah so we're gonna take her to Sopot and give her a good walk <laughs> give her a good walk We're just walking on the pathway next to the beach and the greenery here is absolutely incredible this bridge reminds me of dirty dancing i think in the summer i'll start a little dirty dancing trend i say start that's dependent on people but just do one find myself a patrick swayze Everything here is so beautifully done. These flower circles, there's two over there. The fountain, my goodness, it's so clean. We're in Sopot. Show them the wonky building. The building's built wonky. It's a drunk building. Drunk. It's a wonky building. Yeah.
have just stopped in the Greenway in Sopot, which is a vegan and vegetarian restaurant that's been here for years. It was actually one of the first we found years and years ago, and the menu looks amazing. It's got so much better. But today on the specials, there's a vegan carbonara, and it's a rarity that we find a vegan carbonara, so we're so excited. We've also gone for the Mexican stew with buckwheat, a carrot ginger juice each, and then we're gonna have a sea buckthorn tea. And those of you that didn't know, sea buckthorn has omega-7 in it, which is, omega-7 is very hard to get. So whenever we come to Poland, we make sure we top up on our omega-7, drinking or eating lots of uh, buckthorn. So yeah, had a really nice walk. It is cold, but when the sun's out, it's lovely. And yeah. We're going to eat, so I'm going to get her ears cleaned and then we're going to head home to have a massage later, which I'm so excited for. Okay. Places here are so beautiful. There's three colourful bikes, a swing. You can imagine in the summer it would be so beautiful, but we are heading just here to grab a matcha latte for the walk back home. The decor inside places here is, is just it's amazing and it's so clean. And there I am ordered a matcha latte with oat milk and I'm very excited. I actually haven't shown you an outfit of the day. Well it's not much you can see but I'm wearing a colourful standard 100% organic wool hat, my Tartan Blanket Company um, wool scarf. I think the colour of this is oat. I can't remember. I'll link it below. Celine sunglasses, my Lou Lemon cloud jacket that I've had for, I don't know, maybe 10 years, a lion leggings and emu Uggs. Super cozy. And oh, I've also got on my cashmere and Norway cashmere underneath and I am nice and cozy. And there's the other two. This is Holly. Hello. <laughs> and there's Steph. Nice to meet you. Yeah, they know you already. <laughs> Oh, there's more seating here. Well, look how nice oh, I didn't realise. Well, look That's at the end. Doorway. That's a guitar doorway. That's incredible. Wow, and you can see the beach. We've just come out of the massage and we are in the vegan cake shop getting cake and latte. And this is the choice that we have. It's incredible. So we're going for, this is an apple cake. So we're going for the apple cake, the chocolate cherry. And that's my pick because you guys know I'm obsessed with chocolate. And this is um, a coconut tart with caramel and toffee and all this goodness. It's incredible, I'm so excited. Then we're getting beetroot lattes. And this is the place, it's called Food Cafe. And uh, just, I'm so happy it's here, basically. I feel like I'm not getting the chance to speak to you guys as much as I'd like to. But it's a holiday and I'm just enjoying it and I'm getting into it and relaxing. Even in the massage, I just found that um, I couldn't like completely relax. Just, I'm like this, but by the end of it, I kind of did. So we booked ourselves in for like a two hour on the last day to finish off the trip, basically. But yeah, we're gonna eat cake now and then head home to get an early night for another jam packed day tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to, um, I'm getting my hair cut finally, oh my goodness, and we are heading into Gdansk city centre. Show Holly around of course because she's never seen it and there's a shopping mall so yeah it's going to be like a full day out so we're very excited. Need to get an early night so we um fresh for the morning. Oh you've done such a lovely job, thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna Look, get. she made a heart. Oh, she actually put a heart. She goes, I tried to make a heart. This 
girl is just so, She's so lovely. lovely. No, she no, makes no, all no, the no, effort no, for no, you. No, These are our beetroot lattes topped with rose petals. Oh my goodness, this is the apple cake. That's like it. It's beautiful. Thank you. I hope that it also tastes good. Yes, I'm sure it will. There's the chocolate cake and there's, I don't know what that is. She's so sweet. Isn't she? It's our like midnight feast. Well, not quite, nine o'clock feast. Good morning, everybody. I look slightly more presentable to you today. We are up, ready to go and get our hair done. What isn't presentable is our hair, but that will change in the next hour. So, nice. so greasy and so dry. Look at those ends, I cannot wait to get them cut off. Um, but we are heading to the hairdresser. We're gonna have breakfast first, and then we are going to Gdańsk for the day for a walk around. It looks like it's gonna rain. Luckily, there's a really good shopping mall in the city centre, it's called Forum. So we'll go there and if it gets any better, then we'll head outside. Um, but yeah, having the best time, as yeah, always. Yeah, that short. Steph's, oh, Steph's going short, like short, short. So we'll see. I should actually show you my hair, but I can't. It's absolutely, it's horrible. Outfit for today, very simple. Black leggings from Tala, boots Malone Solier. This jacket is from Estia, it's actually a new piece and I absolutely love it. I've popped on my Chanel brooch just to give it something a little extra. I just have NPL cashmere underneath for warmth and my Chanel classic flap. Oh, and Celine Sunnies because I have, I have hope that the sun's gonna come out. Hello, here we are. So this is avocado, but we head to the hot next door, which is the same restaurant, but it's got avocado spot, it's, um, it's got breakfast. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> there literally has just been a delivery of cakes and milk. Incredible. I think there's more coming. <gasps> what is that? I don't know, but it just looks amazing. Oh, wow. Happy birthday to me. That one? Oh my goodness. That's pomegranates. That's pomegranates all over it. I can see it all. <gasps> There's a chocolate one. There's a chocolate one. Oh my goodness. Oh no, I need one of those. She's putting away Of course she is. Wow. Thank you. With the seeds on the top is a sweet Oh, amazing. Yeah, that's great. We've gone for scrambled tofu this morning. It comes with a sweet bread. We've asked for a sweet bread. And chai latte. Breakfast of dreams, really. So this is my hair length at the moment. I don't want to lose the length, but I have to. Yes, it feels amazing. Oh wow. Oh that's so short. <laughs> Bearing in mind like the length of the front of your hair right now. Like where the hair is, at the front to the back, it's like from there to there. Oh, I can't wait. I know. Oh my goodness. It looks so good. Oh, it's really nice.
Gdansk is renowned for its amber and there is so much to see, all the jewellery, earrings, rings, in fact my grandmother had a few necklaces. Holly's been invited to um, <laughs> busk here in Gdansk. Come on Holly, show us what you got. vending machine with flowers. How cute is that? <laughs> Put your money in. Grab some flowers. Lovely. These are the little things I love about Poland. Just as I've come out the toilet, a little shoe shining machine. You could have on already for me. Because you could have weed on your shoe. Literally could have weed on my shoe. <laughs> but look at the shine, look how shiny. Oh my God, Hello everyone, I haven't spoken to you all day. Purely because it was so cold outside. I, just, I couldn't get my hand, just couldn't stay out with the, with the camera. But we've had such a nice day and I've showed you the site. And now we are having some dinner at our favorite, one of our favorite places here. It's called Mandu. It's a pierogarnia, which is a, is a place with, that sells just pierogi. And they've literally got, I don't know how many flavors, probably about 50 that also do vegan. One thing I'd like to highly recommend here is the hot um, lemonade. And this is with raspberries. They do like a few others. And there's actually raspberries in here. And so the creamy white veg soup which has coconut milk and it's vegan so I'm starting with that and then we're going to order our pierogi which I think is just going to be the potato it's called they're called ruskia so it's the potato and cottage cheese but obviously in uh, vegan and they do great sauerkraut and a great apple and carrot salad so that's what we're having starving it's like eight o'clock and we haven't eaten since breakfast and it's been cold and yeah is their chickpea omelette and oh my goodness it's incredible like, can I show you inside it's stuffed oh my goodness with mushrooms it comes with avocado it's amazing good morning it's another day but a raining one it's miserable outside and we've come in to the Videl chocolate shop I'm not miserable for <laughs> For pure chocolate with oat milk and um, a orange cream orange tea, Holly has one for nothing vegan here. <laughs> a very, <laughs> a very was it orange? Oh, <laughs> orange and um, chocolate, and it's squirted Ginger. in my face. <laughs> Ginger. So this is our setup Ginger. for now until the rain stops, and then we're really going to go to the mall because. <laughs> It's, um, it's the only option really and we haven't been shopping to be honest so but for now I'm going to enjoy this <laughs> let me explain to them so basically in our car rental we found this bag of coins that say um, uh, it says I can't believe that no cash I know I just put it in all of these sort of 
um, gaming places and putting them in and we've just found a gaming place where they work and we've just won this. We don't know what it means, but the ticket eater, I don't know. We've got to find out. So we've got probably about half an hour to Hey, where are we gonna go? Holly's climbing into this machine <laughs> and it looks like it's for children. <laughs> Watch your sunglasses. You've still got. Do you start again. Oh no! Have you just have you just done the most you can do? Okay. Seventy-two. I don't know what that means. Oh, here's come Oh my lord! Here we go again. <laughs> you press the scissors and then it cuts that string. Oh look! And then you get. Oh, I'm trying to cut the string. Oh no. Numbers, come on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. What is it? Oh okay. Go, go, go. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's good. Oh, she's back at the beginning. Last coin. Spin and win. Spin. Come on, get her out of here. We've got to go in. Collect our ticket. No, that's all right. Cash in. Eater. We've got like six slots So we've got 179 so far. That's not, that's so what does that mean? <laughs> this this is the burger that you get at Avocado and it is just sensational. It's huge. We also got the strawberry and cherry homemade lemonade which is lovely sensational I would say I mean I haven't tried it but it looks sensational I just had to show you guys the inside of this burger there is a layer of peas I absolutely love peas this looks incredible neither this is a incredible good morning everybody it's very early and is this one's birthday Yay. happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday to stavania happy birthday to you and it's snowing so we're at gdansk airport it's uh, three in the morning we have a very early flight and we've been walking around thinking it's blooming cold it's been so cold this week we have snow it's been snowing we've had an amazing time it has just been that little bit too cold but we're heading back to london and uh, yeah i'm gonna go straight to bed i think birthday celebrations for you will have to be the 22nd oh, i'm happy man for my birthday go to bed <laughs> yeah that's a good birthday so you've had a good birthday it's been a good birthday week yeah